We are the champions, my friend. Donna, Donna. Is this a new thing? Do you think this should be a new thing? Where I sing our intros? I won't. I'm not going to do that. I might. I don't know. What can I say? Welcome. Welcome. To the last edition of the 2021 Sunday Morning Beer Drinkers for the championship. I'm so glad to have you. It's been a really, really, really interesting season, hasn't it? I mean, there you were thinking you were doing so well and you drafted your entire team so well and then COVID and then injuries and then somehow we're left with uh Josh Kessler and Johnny Soling battling it out for the top two spots. I digress. That might sound like I think that they're not deserving. And I don't think that. I think they both had fantastic seasons. I just think that like my team was supposed to be really, really good. And it then it just wasn't. So uh that's just a little personal frustration coming out anyway i'm moving on moving on let's have a little review shall we take a look right here nope wrong side right here you see 169 to 86 that's a butt whooping boys Man, did Kessler come with some fire. Jamazing Chase. In our league, put up 44 points. Throw on top of that a little Dak Prescott magic. A bunch of running backs scoring in the double digits. He also has Cooper Cup, who hasn't sucked for the entire year. And the Green Bay Packer defense didn't lose the game. So... That leaves Johnny with, uh, what's your rebuttal, Johnny? And he says, well, I have um, Ezekiel Elliott. And I have uh, Devontae Parker? Question mark? Okay. So, as you can see, the final was rather one-sided. So I would like all of us to go ahead and celebrate Josh Kessler. Here are some little known facts about our newest champion. Josh Kessler was born of a father and a mother. His father was a hamster and his mother smelt of elderberries. He moved to Washington State during his formative years. He has held jobs, is a card carrying member of the Millennial Snowflakes. He's an avid co-ed recreational softball player and has dabbled in professional bowling he's never competed in an eating contest officially but he also doesn't lose he's currently in college pursuing a double major in the mathematical probabilities of the four-way parlay and gender equity studies josh kessler has many great traits the first being his dog. That's a great dog. That's such a good dog. What a good boy. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Easy, you are. He's a good boy. The second being the beard that he had one time. His beard has gone through many transformations, which I will illustrate for you here. But I think its crowning achievement was this photo that was documented on a chairlift in the dead of winter, you can see that it is both full, angular, and strong. And I think that outside of his radiant personality, 
his facial hair is probably his strongest asset. I'd like to congratulate the newest champion of the Sunday Morning Beer Drinkers. The first time he's etching his name on that big old badass trophy. He's going to have to fly up here to have us a drink. So, make sure that you're at the party. I'm going to coordinate with him. Find out what time's good. When he's going to be back in the area. And then we're all going to get together and have us a little shindig. It bears mentioning that the rest of the people... There are other people that finished in... uh, you know, decent places, as in, like, second, which was the often bridesmaid, but never the bride, Johnny Soli. And the newest addition to the Sunday morning beer drinkers, the Wild Salmon, happily coming in third, and I'm sure at least making their money back. I'm sure they did. Uh, So, grats. Grats to everybody. Thank you for a great season. Uh, I love you. I hope you're all well and healthy, and I cannot wait to do it again. Let's get together this uh, in, a, in a month or two. Let's drink some beers, eat some good food, and then obviously I will see you at the Draft Party sometime next year. Well, this year, later this year, after some, in August or September-ish. Cheers, friends. See you later. That was for you, Phil.